What's up guys, welcome back to Goshen's Games and welcome back to another beginner's guide on Sword Art Online Memory Defrag. Um, so last time we discussed the party system, or not not the party system, but the uh, the character the, the characterization menu. Um, so today we're going to discuss the items, um, how to improve your items, how to uh, how to evolve them. So in order to get in order to improve your items, you need to go to your menu and then go to upgrade. Once you're in Upgrade, it takes you over here to Lisbeth Smith's shop. Now, all of this is explained in the tutorial. So, you go ahead and you upgrade your item by clicking on Upgrade, and then you click on the item that you want to upgrade. So, let's just go ahead and click on this one, Sword of Diva. So, we're going to upgrade this, and we can upgrade the level. Uh, we can upgrade this item to level 20 because it's a 2 star. So, 1 star you can upgrade to level 10, 2 stars 20, 3 star 30, 4 star 40, and so on and so forth. So, um, it goes up to 5 star items because there's a couple 5 star items already. So, we'll go ahead and we will uh, upgrade this to level 20. So, we'll go ahead and do that. And the stats improve immensely once you do it because you can see attack goes from 159 to 477 and critical rate uh, jumps up as well. Now, uh, reason why I upgraded this item. Okay, there's uh, this is a farmable sword. Okay, it's a pretty good farmable sword. Um, it gives all unit characters a buff so all sword wielding unit characters it will give them a buff other characters can use this sword as well which makes it a pretty decent farmable weapon okay so what we're gonna do is I'm actually gonna go ahead and show you guys where to farm certain weapons especially if you're new and you're free to play uh, so we'll go ahead and we will do that right now so let's go ahead into the menu and the quest um, and the reason why we're doing this is because they, it's all tied in together. So in order to evolve the sword and turn it from a 2-star to a 3-star, I need to grind the same sword uh, over and over. Um, so we'll go ahead and do that. This is not the, the mission that we're supposed to be in. In order to grind that weapon, okay, you can go, uh, you go to this one, Equipment Creation Event, which is uh, the Ordinary Scale Special Edition. Um, so it's recommended for Ordinal Scale Yuna, which is, you get her from playing this event, uh, you'll get her as, uh, as a mission unlock. Um, so, now, here's the thing, okay, enemy level is 30 for the first quest. Now, if you go and you click on it and you hold the, hold it down, it shows you what the item drops are. So, the item drops when you're fighting, uh, level 30, Sword of Diva, R2, um, so that's rank 2, or... I believe it's ranked two. Uh, other things to note that it, that this uh, this boss drops is the holy uh, crystals, as well as a void medallion, which void medallions you're going to use to improve uh, certain characters, such as this Yuna that you get. Um, so then here's the other thing: like it'll show you times rewards. So you need to beat it under 120 seconds in order to activate the S rank. So okay, so there's that. Now. Um, like, like I said, you go ahead and you click and hold on each one. Can I, can I do it please? And it continues to show you like what the drops are. Um, see now this rank has a chance to drop fire medallions as well, which is again, you use fire medallions to improve other characters. Uh, and then quest three again, will drop more stuff. So quest three can drop sort of diva R three as well as R twos. Um, and it can drop rainbow candy boxes, which is another item that you would use to improve, uh, Yuna and other characters. Cause I believe it's an accessory. Um, here's the thing. I am not high enough, uh, or not high enough. Uh, my characters are not a high enough level in order for me to run, uh, this event level 80 quest three properly. Now. I, I'm, I know that a lot of you free-to-play players will probably run into that same kind of issue. 
Now, the other way to do this, because, again, having that R3 sword is one of the better things to do, because what happens when you go ahead and you grind the R2 swords, and you evolve it, so you turn it from a 2-star to a 3-star, it then turns into the Sword of Diva R3. Um, so, in order to then uh, evolve the R3 Sword of Diva into an R4, you need to grind out another 3 diva r3s but there's ways around it and the ways around it is you grind out the r2s and you use the r2s and level those up and evolve those into r3s and then take all the r3s and put them into an r3 to evolve it into an r4 it's a longer way to do things but it's it's definitely a, a way to do it to improve upon you know your character so i'm gonna go ahead and go go into this i go i do it on the 50 rank because 50 rank is pretty easy like i can just destroy it um and if you have if you have characters like around uh 60 to level 60 to level 70 you can pretty much destroy this event pretty pretty damn easy like no joke so we'll go ahead and, and jump in there uh i probably should have changed my team and put asana in there but that's okay um so there we go okay so it's a, it's an easy event and the reason why i said if you have level 60 to level 70 is because when you have level 60 to level 70 most likely you've activated their battle skills or their uh their sword skills in some cases and so that's this skill right here and basically with that you just destroy the boss um so yeah let me just go ahead and switch the kirito because he's my hardest hitting unit to be honest uh so we just use the r3 skills and you just like you'll wreck them you'll wreck the boss so let me just keep on doing that oh i missed well that that sucks Let's try this again, shall we? Now, again, reason why I said level 60, level 70, because you're you're strong enough to be able to just like just take the hits and you don't have to worry about dodging or anything like that. So I believe it dropped one of the items. We're gonna see right now. Um So let's see here. If it dropped the sword, that would be great because I needed one more to to in order to do this. It did. Perfect. It dropped the sword. And so what we're going to do now, we're going to go ahead and back up out of the event. Sweet. Cool. That, that, that works. Uh, I needed that. All right. So we're going to back up out of the event and then I'm going to show you how to evolve the items. Okay. Uh, so we'll go back to the menu. Go back to upgrade. Oh no, I'm sorry. I gotta go claim the item first because the item goes into your gift box. I forgot to mention that. See, the item goes right into your gift box. So we'll go ahead and just claim all while we're here. All right, so go back to upgrade. And now while we're in upgrade, we go into evolution. So now I already have one where I've, uh, I've upgraded it to level 20. So go ahead and click on it because you need two of these swords in order to evolve it. So click on both the swords, evolve. And then it tells you how much coal you need in order to process the evolution. Once you do the evolution, then what will happen is it's going to put it back down to level 1. Alright, so we'll go ahead and do that. I right, just skip it. It's going to put it to R3 now. And so now, even though I don't have enough items to do it just yet, because I, I need two more R3 swords in order to evolve the sword that I have into an R4. Um, but with that being said, that is how you go ahead and you evolve the items. That's, that's what you do. So, uh, basically my recommendation as far as grinding items out, as far as armor and weapons, um, just for like what's available right now, um, grind out this event for the sword. Okay. Do it level 50. If you can, if you can do it higher, do it higher. Uh, the other, the other, uh, stage to grind out would be, where are you at? 
Um, oh, it's right here. The other stage you grind out would be this one because you're gonna grind it out for um, you're gonna grind it out for the armor that it drops, which I'm in the wrong wrong thing. So where are you? Where are you? Right here. So you're gonna grind it out for the armor that it drops, the battle the battle coat and the battle dress. So anyways, let me know if this video helped you out. Hit the like button. Subscribe if you guys are new. Let me know in the comment section um, if it if you found it, if this video informative at all. And if you have, awesome. Uh, with that, I will catch you all later. You guys have a great rest of your day, night, whatever time zone you're at. Peace out, guys.